today I'll be showing you the nice CNC dry pack tail bag, 66 liter bag. Nice CNC reached out to me and asked if I could test out one of their bags. And I said, heck yeah, I do not have a dry bag yet. And this thing, this thing is legit. On a budget, I mean, I don't know if you can find anything much cheaper with this type of quality. I double checked as of today, October 26th, 2023, the bag is going for $53.99 on their website. I will throw a link in the description box below to this exact bag if you're interested in one. They come in two different color variations, this carbon fiber black and yellow with red straps. Packed it with camping gear, enough clothes for something you would probably typically take on a weekend trip. I already have it on the bike. I will show you how I install this in a second. But since we're here in Johnny Park, let's go do some off-roading and see how these straps hold up. see how the straps held up on the duffel bag still tight nice I'll show you how to hook those up in a second but let's get the bag off and I'll show you what I packed in this thing to get it off there's just two straps front and rear clips one two three and four easy as that ready to go So let's see what I managed to fit in this 66 liter duffel bag. There's two more clips on the side and two on the top. The two on the side, this, they secure the roll down. I'll show you that once we pack it back up. And two on the top just help that stay close together. The zippers are waterproof as well, so just extra security for you. All right, I got a pair of pants, sweater, two pairs of socks, a couple of shirts, two pairs of underwear. That's probably enough for a weekend with the clothing. I have my Kilty sleeping bag. I have my sleeping pad. I have my camp chair, sleeping pillow, and of course my tent all the way on the bottom. There you go. So I would say that's, that's quite a bit and I honestly could have fit a little bit more if I didn't want to roll this up. On the inside there's an extra little pocket. I didn't put anything in there. This go around but if you want to separate maybe toiletries or something small there's that as well as an extra little pocket on the outside. And here's a shoulder strap that did come with it. I'm not a huge fan of them, but if you are, it comes with the duffel as well. And the outside is vented, so if you have some wet socks or you wanna dry some flip-flops out here while on the road, perfect spot for them. So, Let's throw this all back in here and I'll show you how to wrap it up. All right, we have everything back inside. Now to roll this up, go ahead and zip it up. Find your air valve. So 
on the side. What you want to do is roll, and you can hear that, the air coming out. Just compress everything nicely. That should be good. Go ahead and close that air valve. Side clips, one, and two. Top clips, one, and two. All these straps are fairly long, which is good. I mean, you don't want to have them too short, but they have these little Velcro deals. Just roll them up, and boom. They're not flapping around on you. Same on the sides. They have a little Velcro for the excess strap. Let's go throw it back on the bike. Let me just show you really quick how to get these on your bike. Just simply loop them. You're going to have to find what spots work best for your bike. But you have this lower loop. Top part through. Secure. Clip. Now these are already adjusted to the length that I want them. So it goes quick and easy. The bag is actually made out of some kind of PVC fabric. Don't ask me, but it's waterproof and I happen to have this water bottle with me. Let's get a little test. You can see I just deflects all that. A few other things I did forget to mention. It does have these little side reflectors, left and right, as well as a double thick bottom. So if you're tossing this thing around when you're out and about, that should definitely help with the durability of this. I mean, overall, I think Nice CNC did a fantastic job. For this price point, I don't think you're gonna find anything better. Unfortunately, it is coming to the end of riding season, but I will definitely be using this bag in the future. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you in the next one.